The National Hip Hop Museum is getting ready to hold its grand induction ceremony ne next week. And joining us this morning with more is Master G and Erica Parham. Good morning. Good morning. So you guys have brought us some really cool stuff. Why is it important for you to get involved? Well, I'm the executive director yes. of the museum. So, and of course, you know, I brought hip hop to the world. <laughs> We're the first commercially successful hip hop group yes. ever. Yes. And so it's my part of my legacy is to preserve the, the culture. And mm -hmm. that's what it is. So I, it really is important that I make sure that people know, you know, how it started, where it came from, and the people that contributed to that. And it's been a big year for hip hop too, because we've been celebrating the 50th yes. anniversary of it. So it has really been a big deal. Huge. Yeah. Huge. Shoot. So this makes this makes it even more important because mm -hmm. you know what we're doing with Karis One and you know, Roxanne Chate and Curtis Blow and these are all you know friends of mine that we've been doing this thing. People for that years. laid the foundation. People that put it put the work in. That's yes. right. That's yes. right. And so tell us about the collection of gold, platinum, and diamond awards. Yes. So what we have is we have a multitude of uh, Death Row. We have uh, some of Karis One stuff. We have a multitude of awesome phenomenal uh, uh, awards that we want people to come check out and see. Yes. So what have you brought for us on this table? Yes. So we have... And Erica, uh, you yeah, feel free to jump yeah, in yeah, here, yeah, too. Right, say, Jordan, it, it's, it's a couple of our retail <laughs> items yes. that we have here. We have Master G's um, Sugar Hill Gang sneakers. We have the newest ODB sneakers by Ewing. Um, Salt and Pepper. We have um, the newest Master P, like a Southern rapper okay. that we don't always have. Yeah, Dante Ross, a and producer, the new um, ODB figure. So, yeah, we have a, a, a lots of things we have at the retail store. And this is really cool. Right. So people, is this a physical brick and mortar? Yes. Or is this yes. something people go online? No, no, no. You can come to the hip hop shop. That's mm -hmm. where we have all of this cool stuff. Hip hop yeah. shop is 18th Street Northwest in DC. You come mm -hmm. through the hip hop shop. And then we also have a gallery on Georgia Avenue across from Howard University where we have the, the plaques and a lot of the artifacts. And this grand induction ceremony, tell us about that. Ah, so April 4th at the RIAA, we are inducted. KRS-One, Roxanne Chante, Curtis Bull, and a multitude of other, again, like I said, legends, people that, as I said, I, that I really enjoyed and have brought so much love to the uh, to the culture. So we're doing it, and uh, and we're, like I said, we're pre preserving the legacy. And feel free either of you to answer, but, um, you know, some folks want to know why is it so important to preserve the history of hip-hop and to really keep, you know, because it has changed so much over the years. Why is it uh, so important to honor those who laid the, the platform for hip-hop? But it was really so much about unity and power and getting your voice out there when it started. Is that still the case? Absolutely. You know, hip-hop is a, a voice of the young, and it's also a voice of the people. So what we're doing is making sure that young people still understand the history and that the people have an opportunity to get what they uh, enjoyed uh, going on now 51 years. Yeah. All right, guys. Thank you so much for Thank joining you. us this morning. Right.